Hi guys, Tom from Stand Out Blogger here. Uh, I just want to today take you through a great tool that I've found that has allowed me to create ebook covers in under five minutes uh, without the need for Photoshop. Uh, I don't know if you've seen my recent post on Stand Out Blogger. Uh, it's not actually mine, it's actually a guest post by James Adam, The Eight Characteristics of a Successful Ebook. Uh, it's a fantastic post. Um, if you haven't read it, head over and check it out. Uh, but as the image that I included with the post, I used this great software called ebook cover creator uh, to create the image that I used in the post. Um, as you can see it looks fantastic uh, and that took me probably about four minutes flat to create using this great software. So what I wanted to do is just give you a run through of the software itself. This is uh, the page for the for the software eCover Creator 3D. Um, as you can see there is a video on the page but a lot of people don't don't give as much credibility to videos that are on sales pages because they think that they're doctored and things like that so what I wanted to do is take you through uh, me myself actually going through the process uh, let me just open up the website what you do is when you purchase uh, this product they give you access to um, their website you have a login and password and um, what it does is it actually stores all your um, all your ebook covers and stuff so that you don't have to post them on your thing so let me just log in for a second um, so this is the dashboard uh, what we want to do is we're going to create a cover um, We'll launch the editor. You, what you can do is you can either use an image that you've created yourself or you can um, use one of their pre-made designs. I quite like their pre-made designs. They've got different styles. Uh, we'll be using the social site style this time. Uh, so give your ebook a title. So we'll call this one Awesome Ebook. Uh, click on one of the design styles. And what that will do is that will open up the actual editor so that we can edit the cover of the ebook. Um, so, what we've got is in this style alone, we've got a couple. We've got a YouTube one, a WordPress cover, a Google cover, Twitter, Squidoo, and social media, which is the one that I used myself. Um, once you can do that, you can add a couple of icons. Personally, I give this a miss. I just think it looks a little bit too corny. Um, so what we're going to do, uh, you can just move the text around. Fastest way to become awesome fast. Uh, well, let's change this to um, this ebook will help you become awesome. Uh, we'll change the title to the awesome. Ebook. Uh, we'll just call it Awesome Ebook because that's pushing it down. Um, yeah, and then we can change all this text here. Um, we can change it to if you need an ebook to teach you how to be awesome. Uh, I think you need a bit of help. Or you can obviously you can change it to whatever you want. Uh, add a bit of a testimonial down here. Change your name, Thomas Sinfield. Standoutblogger.com. And then that's it. Um, and then if you want to add a bit more to it, you can add barcodes, DVD symbols. Give it a bestseller sticker, 100% free ribbon, which is great for free reports. Uh, and then save, I'll uh, push that up so you can see it. Save your new 3D graphic. And it's just creating the different sizes. Uh, this is the bit that I quite like. Um, if we go create 3D cover, uh, it pops up with the different styles. Uh, of ebook, DVD cover, magazine, 
so what you can actually do is if you're creating a whole package you can do the DVD, the ebook, the the magazine Here we go. Uh, so here's a couple of covers that I've made. Uh, that was the one that I made for the actual uh, post, but we'll use the new one. Uh, so click on the cover that you want to create. Uh, and as you can see here, you got cover size, small and large, the background cover, the background color that you want. So we'll just keep that as white. And you got uh, soft book cover, and it creates it right in front of your eyes. Uh, as you can see, that's quite good. You've got the hardcover version, the modern DVD case. I quite like this one. I used this one uh, for the for the pop up domination pop up that I have on my new project website builder. I use this style. We've got the white DVD case and magazine. Got the DVD case with the DVD popping out the side, uh, and these two I'm not not quite happy with these ones because the monitor kind of stretches it out a bit, which makes it look a little bit tacky. But I guess if you're doing your own original um, covers, you can probably make these look a lot better. And same with the CD, it just I just feel it squashes it a bit. It doesn't look that bad, but what we're going to do is we're going to do the soft cover book. We'll name it Awesome Dash Ebook. Saves the PNG for you. So as you can see, it's quite a handy little tool. Um, I don't know if you've tried to design an ebook yourself. It, especially in Photoshop, it can become quite difficult. I've tried all the action scripts and stuff like that, but this is definitely the easiest way that I've found to create to create an ebook. Um, and if you're looking at outsourcing, you're probably going to pay between 20 and 20 and 50 dollars for an ebook cover. So uh, the cost of this software is uh, 47 dollars. So if you're creating two ebook covers, then you're pretty much paid for it over and above. And there you go, cover saved. There's our new cover there. Uh, it usually says it uh, it's available within seconds, but we'll wait for this to fully load first before we get. Yep, there we go, new graphic saved. So as you can see, it comes out quite nice, easy format, and just right click, save image as, and you've got your ebook completely done. Um, so I, I definitely recommend heading over and at least checking it out for yourself. See the image, uh, the video that he's created on how quickly he does it. Uh, his name is James Dyson. Uh, he has a great blog over at businessjolt.com. Um, and the best thing I love is you don't need Photoshop, which is what's stopping a lot of people from creating their own ebooks. And there's a couple that he's created himself, uh, which come up quite nice. So yeah, $37 I think well worth it. Um, so head over and check it out. I'll add a couple of the links in the bottom of the post. And um, yeah, so that's how I create my ebook covers quickly in, as you can see, a couple of minutes.